Hey guys, Gary Dean, DetailJuice.com. I'm working on one of my Corvettes today and I have put together a brand new, very simple, very low cost air injection system. This new system is awesome because it costs a lot less than I've been working with, but it works even better. I think I've got the secret nailed down. All right, so what I have done is I went ahead and used a pump sprayer. Um, the gun, which you can see over there, will siphon, so it sucks the uh, liquid up through it, but this hose is about 30 feet long, so it struggles a little bit. So if you, if you I modified this pump sprayer to take this hose and then I used the fittings that came with the pump sprayer uh, and then there was a hose and a, um, a spray nozzle that came off of that so I just drilled out this hole this hole in the top here and I used the factory fitting for the spray gun and then the straw that came with it like I said the only modification I made here is I added this 30 foot of hose and I, I drilled out this hole to hold this tight so you can see that is not a compressor that you've seen me have before it is a porter cable nothing fancy in fact I paid $100 plus tax for this at Home Depot uh, it is 150 PSI max 2.6 CFM at 90 it is a six gallon pancake job for $99.99 you can see that I have my uh, air water filter situation. I got quick disconnects on all that. I got my Flexzilla 25 foot hose there. Um, there is a pressure regulator on the unit. I have that set at 80 PSI, you can see that. So with this, you can add some pressure to the deal and it helps the siphon work better so you get better flow and don't have to worry about the siphon so that's the first thing that i've done with that and that's a one gallon pump sprayer uh, this is just some um, reinforced reinforced nylon uh, hose that i got from lowe's a long time ago i just had it laying around and it actually is working fantastic uh, it's got a quarter inch inner diameter, and I think it's three eighths or five sixteenths outside diameter, but the inner diameter is a uh, quarter inch. So I've got that plugged up to the house plug. Pancake air compressor, Flexzilla hose, got to have your inline filter. Like I said, there's a regulator there. So we'll go down to the gun. I put another regulator on the gun. I have that. So if you look, there's two gauges there. One is the tank pressure, which is at 150 PSI, right at that. And this is actually the pressure in the line, which I have, like I said, set at 80. The secret is turning that down a little bit and then turning this down a little bit lower than that. This gauge shows me the pressure that's coming in, which is 80. But when you squeeze this trigger, because I've got it, almost shut off it's not going to give me that flow you have to adjust it uh, but you don't want full flow so when you're limiting it here at the gun and you're limiting it over there at the compressor you're not using full throttle all the time which is good so i've basically done a waterless wash on this side of the uh, corvette already uh, this is just my beater you don't need tons of pressure in that uh in that pump sprayer either just a little bit works fine um, i am going to find a solution to keep these together probably a velcro situation i'm also working on uh, building a harness to hold the gun so that you can do other things but for now uh here we go
and I generally just sit it down, take a clean towel, which I'm not a fan of this waterless situation, but I'm doing a demo. I recently bought this Corvette and I haven't polished it yet, so I don't mind doing a waterless wash. So now that you've got the majority off, you go in with a dry towel and you get the, the rest of it off there. And I'm using Infinite Use Detail Juice 1 in that pump sprayer. Um, I put, I want to say I put two ounces in that pump sprayer and filled it up with water. So that's two ounces in one gallon of water and it's leaving it super slick and nice and you get more out of the product that way but you get less of the good stuff so if you're using the infinite use detail juice one as a protective product which this will be protected it just won't last nearly as long as direct to paint will so. all right i'm not planning on doing more with this uh today after i do the waterless wash i just want to clean it up so i can take the girly friend out to dinner tonight nothing fancy so that's the whole point here is just get it cleaned up while I do my testing I mean, it just lasts and lasts and lasts. It does a great job this way. Cool part about air injection is it's not only to do your pre-soak or to, to spray, a, 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 you know, a low pressure type of spray system. That was the original benefit, but now you can do so much more. The brand new universal dressing can be sprayed out of this thing. I would use that smaller purple gun, uh, the four ounce job. I'll show you that in a different video, but for tire gel or tire spray, uh, even your cleaners, uh, the universal clean and prep, you can spray that out of those things, no problem. Um, obviously I would use another gun and another tank setup. This one's more for the bulk action situation. Uh, but as far as getting the work done, all you need is a couple sprayers and you can get everything you need to get done done even your dressings interior exterior all of it so if you're going to protect your tires you can spray um, you can spray pretty much anything out of it uh, my like i said universal clean and prep and the universal dressing from the new one system can be sprayed out of uh, an HPLV sprayer, which is what that is. Yeah, buddy. Good stuff. So the whole system I'm using right now from the pressure washer, or I'm sorry, not the pressure washer, we're not doing that. From the air compressor, the hose, two guns, the pump sprayer. The pump sprayer, I think, was $10 at Walmart. Um, you can also get those at uh, Home Depot. So 10 bucks there, and then uh, 100 for the compressor. I want to say 30 for the hose. Uh, I use the Flexzilla because they work the best. That you know, they're just 
the really good hoses, very flexible. And uh, I'm trying to add it up for you. So 140, an extra regulator was seven dollars at Harbor Freight. Uh, Harbor Freight. Uh, the gun was 20, so 20, 30. So for well inside 200 bucks, you can get air comp uh, air injection. I mean, it, <laughs> you cannot go wrong. 200 inside 200 bucks, and you got a full blown air injection si situation um, with two sprayers. The pump sprayer you've got um, the other sprayer will have its own uh, tank on it whether it's siphon feed or the gravity feed like the small one I have that's the one that small one I like to do tire dressing and uh, put the universal clean and prep on the front end to break down the bugs before I hit it with this gun this gun has a bigger nozzle on it so you get more flow but that's it guys that's air air injection at its finest and those are the secrets to it it took me a long time and a lot of patience to try to figure it all out but i finally have put together a system that works very well and is quite inexpensive that's all you need oh the other cool thing is my briggs and stratton p2200 generator that i have been preaching about for years uh, that thing runs this compressor so you can be completely mobile with that thing i'm almost positive your honda eu 2000 will almost will also do that too if you prefer honda i've had great luck with the 650 dollar briggs and stratton job so not unhappy with that i buy those on amazon i have three or four of them but that's it air injection secrets no longer it is definitely a good deal and um, very affordable now so I'm excited for you guys to get rolling on it, but if you got if you need more information about the parts, it's not complicated. Uh, check out Gary Dean's Detail Juice Nation. It's a group on Facebook where we talk about only my products, my processes, and what I've got going on. We do talk a lot about air injection, and air injection and the new one system is the future of my company. It's great, guys. You're want you're gonna want to get on board. Thanks so much for watching, and have a wonderful day.